Yo, what's good, everybody, man? It's your boy Hoopball Gaming, man. Just because this video starts, man, I just want to tell you guys, you guys want to stay for this video. Alright, this will be the best coin making guide on YouTube, and there, I pulled the best poll of my life—a six million coin worth poll. I must watch. Stay tuned. Alright, let's get it. Yo, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Hoopball Gaming back again with another video, and today we are going to be releasing the ultimate that's right the ultimate ultimate coin making guide now this is probably my most requested video out of all my videos man we're gonna get straight into it man you guys know how it is man i'm gonna be teaching you guys how to make money from the market using sniping filters how to make money off sets how to make money off live events anything all right just for you guys to get some coins to have fun on this game all right so i know some of you guys are struggling with the game most of you guys probably aren't but some of you guys are so you know what that's okay i'm here to help y'all out all right so let's just get straight into it man first off i just want to say that this record on the day when defensive unit set just came out so i'm going to be opening this defensive unit set at the end of the video i right? this cost me more than a million to uh to get all right that's why i don't have that much coins right now but hey i'm gonna be sniping y'all know how it is right? these filters will guarantee you money all right sometimes i made a mil in a day that, like I, I can't even believe it myself man but let's get straight into it man first off i'm gonna show you guys how to make money off of sets now first see this set right here now i'm gonna be doing a, a video on i'm gonna be doing a part later on sniping filters so i'm gonna show you guys why this is important so we're gonna get a gold game plan uh pack this isn't the best game plan but there we got a gold long pass so basically if you snipe those silver game plans you could upgrade them to gold and right now like there's a ton of players here and i'm gonna be showing you guys how to make your own sniping filter so first off you definitely want to use the set now because there are new sets today released into the game the elite trophies are worth way too much they cost 30k right now elite players cost 55k right now elite uh trophies cost 30k these players probably cost like 4k now i'll be honest with you all right because they everyone knows if you complete the set you're getting gold all right so what you guys want to do is you guys want to bid you guys do not want to go and buy these players you want to bid on these players now how much do you bid for well i usually put them at around 1900 to around 2200 all right but today that's gonna be different because huh you're not gonna be winning anything all right uh i'm gonna be getting uh, I'm gonna try to get one pack and I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna show you guys how much money you can make from this set. Here we go, guys. So I'm gonna be showing you guys this set will make you money. I <laughs> really hope this set. There's gonna be bad ones, all right? So I'm just gonna put that out there. There's gonna be bad ones just in case there's a bad one, man. And it looks like it's not gonna be that good, but you know what hey there you go so that's five gold trophies now even though if you didn't get it if we got an elite out of that that we would have made a ton of money but that's okay you know why because the gold trophies at the moment are worth a ton of coins all right now let's go check on the market how much gold trophies go for so guys these are going for 6k man look at this bro so if those are going for 6k i paid around 24 to 20 23 24k all right if i sell all of these gold trophies for 6k each uh including tax i'll make it back around 25k now you guys are probably thinking wow that's not that's not profit right but you could also sell the silver trophies and the bronze trophies now silver trophies usually go for a k but now that i think they're going for a bit more i'm listing them up for 1.6 all right so that's gonna be a lot of profit and if you get an elite trophy that's automatic profit so think of all the profits you can make from that man if you pull three or four elite trophies man you're balling out in like two seconds all right so that's our first usage of set filter all right you can also use the silver player trophy set now this set won't give you as many elite trophies i don't think like the odds are a bit lower but i'm just gonna open a couple of these since i have a ton of silver uh players sitting around there we get a gold trophy there so you can make a ton of money from this uh filter as well if you guys are just sniping silver players you know there's a ton of individual silver players i won't get to those yet because i feel like you guys should know who they are but if you guys don't know who they are i'll, I'll tell you guys in another video all right because i have some filters i want to focus on in this video all right so that's pretty much for the sets to be honest because uh mvps just came out today and 
X Factors just came out. Uh, there's like, I think there's like boosted attributes, something like that. And there's a new trophy monster, Stefan Gilmore. So we're gonna get straight into the sniping filters, what you've all been waiting for. I right? now you guys probably want to 66k. Like I'm saying, guys, I'm gonna do some packs at the end with that 66k, and I'm gonna have a defensive game plan. All right, that costs a, 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 like 1.3 mil. So, so we're gonna get into some expensive filters first. So, if you guys are rich, but you guys are kind of stuck right now, you know, hey, I got you. All right, so in 20 minutes, this X Factor live event is gonna come out. So you want to filter out X Factor players. You want to go 300k. And you want to filter out everything except for punt returner. You want to go 90 rated. Now, the reason you're doing this filter, oh, I see a Darius Slater, but I'm, I don't think I'm going to buy that one. Uh, you yeah, don't even have the coins, but the reason you do this filter is uh, not a lot of people are on it. That's the main reason, all right? Not a lot of people think that, you know, they're going to drop any of this. But if you see one for 150K, that is 150K in the bank, all right? Now, if you get a Delaney Walker, that's like 400K, sell for a mil, that's 600K. So there's a ton of possibilities on this filter for you guys to make money, all right? Next one, you want to go 91 overall, and you want to go 180K, all right? So you just want to see what there is in the on these 91 overalls. So as you all can see, the have gone down all right so a ton of these players have gone down which isn't that good news but there's a herman moore which would have been pretty juicy all right so really here you're just kind of looking looking on about all right there's not really a specific player you want this is kind of a hard filter for you guys so i wouldn't really recommend this filter but i'm just putting it out there just in case you guys do the filter you know you let more people know about it all right next filter you want to do is the most beard filter i believe they're 200k i'm not sure i was sniping this yesterday i got a couple snipes in actually so yeah there's a couple of them but most of these guys, yeah, they're like 150, 160. So if you can grab a cheeky 90K, 80K snipe for these ones, that would also help a lot. Now we're moving on to the signature players. Now this one is probably one of my favorites because I've sniped two of these. Don Terry Post for 200K and I've sold them off for like 600K, all right? So here we go. We're going to go 300K for signature players and there's one up for 299K. Now let's see how much this Randall Cobb goes for. I believe he goes for like 350 or maybe just around 300 someone just dropped them i don't know man but that should not be a snipe i don't think unless there is a 370 yeah there's a 330 yeah, yeah so it's around 300k all right but there's a wait uh there's a greg olsen that just dropped the glover quinn so there's a ton of players here you could snipe for but they, they those filters are usually the ones you snipe afterwards after the round draw after you snipe the ones that have competition all right now next one we want to do is for the cheaper boys all right we're gonna go 82 overall we're gonna get into some filters here we're gonna go 82 overall o guard only for some reason o guards are going for a lot this season i don't know why all right they're offensive guards they don't really make a difference in game but as y'all can see there they they're, if you got those snipes and you sold these uh, these players for 6K. See, there's one up there for 6K. I, I believe you can even sell them for 7K if you wait long enough, all right? You, I believe, yeah, you can even sell them for 7K, all right? So the, this filter is very effective, man, but there are, I believe, a ton of people on this filter. Uh, I'm not really sure, but probably a lot of people, all right? Uh, I don't use this filter a lot just because there's a ton of filters. I don't really like using filters that are so uh, broad. So uh, they're too famous, you know? They're too easy to find out. I like to use filters that are more in-depth, more uh, harder to get, and which is just easier coins. Next one, I used this for quite a long time, but now I don't use it anymore because there's a ton of people on it. Uh, kick returners, gold kick returners. Now, gold kick returners go for a ton. So you want to make sure you want to snipe these for around 10k. 10k is a good snipe because I believe they go for around 15 to 20k. Uh, yeah, so some of these guys go for 13, like Marcus Wheaton, Danny Amendola. But if you get a Tyler Lockett, that's probably like 18k right there. All right. Next one we want to do is elite players. Now you're probably wondering, yeah, this is another broad filter. I'm giving you guys all the filters I can possibly get. This is the ultimate coin guy. All right, we're giving you everything. All right, so see these players right here. See, these ones, oh my goodness, they're going for so much right now. So, you want to make sure you can snipe, get some of these snipes in because of the new game plan defensive unit set. 
and because of the Tom Brady, all right? So these guys are going for so much right now. Elite trophies also, they go for around 30K. Uh, yeah, I'll show you guys right now, 30K right now. So if you can get for, a couple for 22,500, that's what I get these ones for. Uh, you could probably make a ton of money on that. That's like 8K per snipe, which is pretty good, all right? Snipe gold players to complete the set, but I'd recommend bid, uh, bidding, all right? Next one you want to do is you want to go 84 overall. You want to filter all the teams except for the Baltimore Ravens, which is going to take quite a long time. Here we go. Video editing skills, all right? <laughs> then you're going to go uh, filter all the positions except for defensive end, defensive tackle, uh, middle linebacker. You want to go offensive tackle and center. You want to go 10K. And we're going to see, I think there is... Yeah, collectibles. I think we, yeah, yeah, yeah. we have to filter out uh, safety and we have to filter out running back. And this will give you these players. All right, now, these players tend to go for around 15K. So if you snipe one of these for like 10K or lower, you can make a lot of money. Anthony Barr goes for 14K. Alan Robinson, I had to go, say, goes for 12, 13. True Fun goes for 15 on my server. I'm server one, by the way. So that's how these ones work. All right, next one we want to do is we want to go defensive units. Now, this is the ultimate filter. This filter is so rare to get, but once you get one of these boys, man, you're, you'll, you'll be balling, all right? Trust me, you'll be balling. So there we have a Pittsburgh Steelers one that dropped for 1.3, 1.2 for Oakland Raiders. So these are the teams, man. And we're gonna be opening one of these at the end of the video, so make sure you leave a like for that. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, by the way, if you're still not a goof, all right? Now, I'm gonna be teaching you guys live events, all right? Now, today there's gonna be um, a gold, uh, there's gonna be an X Factor live event coming out today. So, what that means is X Factor players are gonna be more common because more people are gonna be playing this, and which means there's more chance that people are gonna get X Factor players, all right? So, what that means is you guys gotta know your live events when there's a live event out or a pack. You need to make sure you're sniping whatever there is because that means there's double or trip or whatever the chances uh multiplied to its original state all right so basically on a normal day there'd probably be like drop like 10 of x factor players would be dropped today probably like 40 because x factor live event just came in so you guys want to make sure you guys want to play the live event you want to be a live event grinder because you know i'm pretty sure you've heard from a ton of Yo, other YouTubers that live event grinding is major, is a major, major key, all right? X Factor, uh, so probably today, I'm probably gonna be sniping some X Factor players, and you guys are gonna be seeing the goof on the auction mark, <laughs> all right? But now I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make your own filters. Now, I just made a filter by myself today, and I sniped it for like around 40 minutes. I made around 200K. So that was pretty good, all right? So I looked at these headliners and I just thought, man, what do the most expensive players, you know? You wanna think the price range, all right? You wanna think uh, the uh, the prices and you wanna think the letters in their name. Now that's key, all right? So I looked at all these players, I skipped this guy. All right, Chris Moore, no, 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 no. Star Lot to Lele, uh, there's a ton of players here. But I started with Damian Williams. I just kept going. I just kept kept on going. DJ White, uh, Melvin Gordon, uh, Eric Kendricks. Yup. Uh, I didn't do you because I don't know why. Uh, Jordan Cameron. I think I, no, I did not do Jordan Cameron. And I think I didn't do John Sue anyway. But oh yeah, and I did Andy Dalton for the AJ Green set. But I completed that set because I pulled Andy Dalton I think three times in that week. It came out all right, but. Let's go here. I'm going to show you guys the filter I made up. So what you guys want to do is you guys want to find the common letter. And I found that it was D. All right. All these players had D in their name. Uh, and then I wanted to go uh, with their teams. All right. So you want to filter this down as much as possible. You want to go Miami. Uh, you want to go the Kansas City Chiefs. You want to go the Cincinnati Bengals. Uh, you want to go Tennessee Titans, Oakland Raiders. Uh, and that's pretty much it. All right. I think, yeah, 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 I think that's it. And then we're going to go running back, quarterback, cornerback. All right. And then we're going to go 80 K and then we're going to filter it by the headliners players program. All right. Now this is going to give you, uh, well, no one at right now, I guess, but I think there's a ton of Damian Williams that were up earlier. Yep. Yep. These boys are up. All right. So you guys can snipe these ones. Um, 
this will give you all the expensive players for your headliners players. So if you guys are looking for headliners players, this will help you a lot. But if you guys were looking to snipe, this filter would be really good. Some some of those 40k snipes, 50k snipes will really help. I so that's pretty much it for all these sniping filters. I have one more filter, but I'm not gonna tell you guys that is my ultimate filter. I made two mil in a day. I, I'm not even kidding with you guys. Two mil in a day with this filter, all right? So leave a like down below and make sure you subscribe for that video and I'll release the ultimate filter in Madden Mobile next video, all right? Or, or next, next, next time I do one of these filters, all right? So let's get straight into it, man. I'm gonna be opening 100K worth of pro pack or 98K, but I'm not gonna be opening these red zone packs, all right? Because last time I opened them, they were just, they were just, they were just bad in general. All right, we got Marcus Peters in that first pack. Here we go, second pack. Come on, come on. Oh, we got Shaquille Barrett. Here we go, third pack of this pro pack opening. Then we're gonna move on to the defensive unit. What we've all been waiting for, we got a Gary Barnage there. Jesus Christ, these packs are not getting out. Three packs and we have not pulled anything. But the good thing about pro packs, this is another method actually making money. Good thing about pro packs is if you pull a lead player right now, you make around 60K, which is a ton of money. And you can use these gold players, bronze players, and silver players to convert into the trophy set, which could make back your money off of trophy. I right? so you never know with these pro packs and there's a ton of program players that will make your money back as well there we go we got a Steelers versus Ravens Lawrence Timmons collectible now I don't know how much that goes for I might check that later but man they took out the flashback set bro like that that annoys me so much because flashbacks were one of my most favorite sets last year man flashbacks were literally the best set in the game all right now X Factor this year they tried to replace it with X Factor oh my goodness there we go goose that's what I'm talking about TJ Lang there he probably goes for like 60k right now so that big ba made back my money and I just got all those free gold players and silver and bronze players for free right so there's a perfect example on how you can make this money for free now we're gonna open three or more of these packs then we're gonna move into the almighty most uh well i hope it's the most your defensive unit uh defensive unit upgrade pack all right now oh my goodness i can't wait for that pack man i've never opened that pack here is the last pro pack man come on EA, can we get, get something good in this last pro pack uh, no, we got Sheldon Rankins. So, you know what? Those, uh, those, uh, pro packs weren't that bad since we pulled that TJ Lang, all right? But here we go. The almighty pack itself. Defensive unit game time award pack. Can we pull some heat out of this pack, man? Please, EA, give me something good, man. Give me, like, a most good defensive unit, man. Come on, I right? Three, two, one. Ooh, we get him. Oh my goodness. No, no. We get a playoff versus two unit. No, no. No, that's a playoff versus two unit. That is a new unit. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Playoff pursuit unit. I swear to God. I, I, I'm not even kidding. I'm not even kidding. Oh my goodness. How much did that go for? Oh my goodness. Six mil. I'm, oh my God. It goes for six mil. Oh. My goodness, no, 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 I pulled six mil, I pulled six mil, oh my goodness, the boys, did you see that, did you see that, oh my god, this game plan goes for six mil, I'm listing it up right now, oh my god, that's six mil, that is six mil, this is five point, let's, let's make it five point eight mil, oh my goodness, that is not, I swear to God, that is not fake. Oh my God. Plus for Excel to New England. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna that for eight hours. Oh my goodness, that is one of the best defensive game minds. That literally just came out today. That literally just came out today. New England Patriots, playoff pursuit unit, up on the market for six mil. Oh my goodness, we just got a six mil point poll boys in this night we built this video, man. So if you guys enjoyed this video, man, make sure you leave a like, make sure you subscribe, and guess what? The goof is out. Peace.